हेलो एंड वेलकम बैक टू अनाद एक्साइटिंग सेशन आई एम यू होस्ट महेश कार या यू वॉचिंग मी ऑन यूट्यूब ना एंड टूडे आई एम गॉन अडे के थ्रू Amazon bracket. So if you are using this for the very first time, so this is something that allows you to execute your uh, quantum algorithms. Okay, so quantum algorithms, uh, algorithms in the sense like uh, the your algorithms if you want to test uh, on quantum processor. Okay, so this is something that uh, allows you to run your uh, things on with using jupiter with using jobs stars you can say so without wasting any time let's deep dive into it so if you are using this for the very first time you just need to search for amazon bracket here and you will get this very first option over here okay so here i have just uh open it here so uh, click here on get started and you can see there are lots of uh keep use providers okay keep use is a quantum processing units okay so similar to cpu but uh this is a uh, kind of third party providers that you can choose from so there are a few of them are online few of them are offline okay based on that you can choose okay this is oxford um provided by oxford quantum circuits is provided by d wave with the qubits of 5760 there's a d wave uh something else i don't know that much about these things but yeah these are the third party providers okay uh and after that what you can do if you are uh, using uh, like notebooks if you are familiar with uh, jupiter so this is something for you guys okay so here this is how you can create your uh notebook instances if you are using this for the very first time you need to create new instance from here you can name it it will be preceded by amazon bracket okay so no worries if you can write uh, your name here okay after that uh, you need to choose the instance type of course so instance type uh, that uh, uh here you can choose from okay so this is the minimum requirement uh, of mlt3 medium okay after that you can proceed with the further things so uh, like uh, you can provide the iam role of course uh, with the proper permissions uh after that existing iam role i already have it okay so after that here you can uh, provide uh, allow allows that uh, it allows that uh, jupyter notebook to uh, root access okay uh, or not it's all up to you encryption key is uh, another thing that uh, if you are uh, if you are not aware about kms which is extra layer of uh, encryption that you can provide with by creating uh, kms key so you can search kms here you can create your uh key here and you can uh, provide that key here for extra security layer but one of this is just for testing so you can hit here on uh, create notebook instance it will take a while so i already have it one okay uh fresh uh, uh i have just created few uh one hour before i guess so i'm not sure why this is taking so much time but it's completely fine uh so what we can do is you can go here in announcements and uh, you can see all the latest announcement of uh by aws okay so there are uh these are third party providers provided uh uh that aws allows you to choose from okay and these uh, here you can um read all the things okay that uh aws bracket is working on so yeah you can see this is a fully managed service to get started with the quantum computing with the amazon bracket you can build the quantum algorithms test them go with the on the quantum circuit of course okay and run them on the different quantum hardware technologies provided uh, that is q uh, p use on uh, amazon bracket okay so yeah let's go back to here i'm i'm not sure this is why this is taking so much time it's some kind of bug i guess or not or because of my network might be uh, let's see once again uh hopefully this time it will work yeah got it so here you can directly click, click here or you can click here on open in jupiter of course how how uh, is that possible it's because of my network of course so yeah you can choose here okay so uh once uh, you you can get this your uh, url as well of your jupiter notebook okay if you are not aware about jupiter notebook of course you can uh, uh, write your python code and test your algorithms here okay there are few algorithm based on quantum uh for which will be available to test on uh qpus let's say so here are few few of them okay so you can choose from uh, which is examples okay let's say this one i want to choose so if you click here of course it will uh, it will 
allow you to run uh, code directly from here okay so you can see this is a kind of grower search algorithm which is uh, that you can test on quantum computer so uh, these are the kind of operations that that are not available like not possible to test on your uh, local machines on very uh, large scale okay so uh, it will be easy for you guys to test such things on uh, qpus okay so yeah this is it i guess this is all we have to do and here there are lots of other options like jobs where you can directly create a job and run your algorithms directly similar for task as well so uh, here in action you can see we don't have any task for now but uh, uh, here you can uh, choose the devices as well let's go here in d wave uh, let's say and uh, you can explore the things uh, guys i even don't uh, have much knowledge about this but this is something that i thought you should know guys so this is a uh, uh, cost of this thing okay you can explore the cost from here as well and you can proceed with the uh, this thing so once uh, you are done with this you can now uh, simply you just need to stop this first after you need to delete this uh, okay and uh, yeah, let me stop this thing it will take a while again and after that i'll delete this thing okay so i don't want to waste my uh things so yeah this is it i guess uh, for this tutorial if you uh like uh, you can explore on your own guys onwards so thank you so much all of you guys for being with me supporting me all the time it's been pleasure to be here please let me know inside comment box what you want from my side and don't forget to subscribe my channel if you haven't already and don't forget to smash that like button so thank you so much good day bye bye